Come on guys, let's introduce you to the Claw Crew Juniors. Or the Junior Claw Crew. <laughs> All the kittens. <laughs> I figured it out, whether they're boys or girls. So let's get into it. As many of you may already know, we have a good number of barn cats here at the Hidden Spring Farm. Now the role of the barn cats is to keep the rodent population under control and they do a great job. Cats are natural predators and <laughs> they are very good hunters and they hunt their prey pretty well every day. They bring me back mice, small rodents, you know, like moles or voles. They're really just amazing hunters. Now, a while back in the spring, we lost two of our favorite barn cats, Stormy and Lovely. And that's what prompted me to build this catio behind me here. And this is an extension of the cat house. And this is where we lock up the cats every night. I'm no longer gonna lose any more cats to predators around the farm. Back in April of this year, Maggie Mae Barncat gave birth to four beautiful little kittens and they've been growing up really fast. They're just amazing little creatures, how quickly they grow. In case you're new to the channel, we have the existing claw crew here at the farm. These are all the adult cats. We have Fozzie Bear, Chunk, Dexter Morgan, and Maggie May. Now these kittens have not been let out free on the farm, and that's not what we're here to do. What I'm here to do today is to bring you guys in and introduce you to the Junior Claw Crew. Now the Junior Claw Crew is hard to wrangle, so I've cornered them in the catio here, so I'll be able to grab them and kind of showcase them to you. So it turns out these kids of Maggie Mae are two boys and two girls. The perfect blend. My Darden and I have named them finally that we've identified their gender. <laughs> so here we go. Chewbacca from Star Wars. Short name is Chewie. <laughs> he's a beautiful tiger stripe cat, but he's got a little bit more black in him compared with the other tiger stripe. He's looking at himself in the camera. <laughs> They're beautiful. They're still very sketchy though. It's okay, buddy. This here is Mango. Mango because he's orange. They're a little scared right now because I'm grabbing them. But here's Mango. <laughs> Mango. Here's the girls. This girl here is Tango. <laughs> Mango is the orange one and this one is Tango. Mango and Tango. She's beautiful. Tango. You're okay, Tango. You're okay. And last but not least, this is the scariest cat it took me just now 10 minutes trying to get her inside this catio. We finally established that she's a she, and she's so fluffy and hairy, and she has super long white eyebrows. <laughs> and here is Bubbles. She's a beautiful, beautiful black and white cat. Some people call them tuxedo cats. She's very scared, but she's almost just like Maggie Mae was when she was a kitten. And look at her, she's looking at me right now. She doesn't know what to do. She, they must know by now that I'm not gonna hurt them. But her name is Bubbles. She's got these huge round eyes. And look at the long whiskers. <laughs> You're okay. She's so scared right now. Her heart is pounding. Now that we have names for them all, I gotta start calling out their name very regularly. So anytime I try to make eye contact with them, I'm always saying like, Mango, 
Chewy, you know, like trying to get them to learn that that's their name. So one day in the near future, when I'm letting them free on the farm, when I call, I want them to come, you know, they're born on the farm. So it's not like I have to barn train them or anything because they're born here. You know, they'll know that this is their home, but I want them to come when I call. Look at Maggie. You got Mango there. It's almost the same size as Maggie. And Maggie's the adult. I really, really love having these cats on the farm. <laughs> they do a great job for us. Too bad that my workshop here has turned into the cat house because it's a mess, a mess. I feel embarrassed even to show it to you because the cats just climb everywhere. The cats climb up in the rafters. They're up on my toolboxes. You know, they, they go up top and they knock everything down. <laughs> Bubbles, what are you doing up there? Ah, Bubbles. <laughs> what are you doing? That's not the right place for you. Get down. Hey, Maggie, you too? That's why everything gets knocked off up there. I got I need my I need a workshop, really. I need a, my own workshop because this can't be a workshop and a cat house. That's crazy. Chunky, you're wrecking that box, buddy. Chunk? Chunky! Stop tearing the box! You're making a mess! Is that fun? <laughs> okay, buddy. What are you doing? What are you doing? Sit. It's all in your hair. You got weeds all in your hair. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, she has these things. How are you doing? Fuzzy. How are you, buddy? How are you? Appreciate you watching. It's always a fun time here hanging out with the cats. And I mean, I really enjoy having the cats. I got nothing bad to say about these cats. They've taken my heart and I'll do anything for them.